And this is in the scent Extra Gentle Soap. That's not a scent. <laughs> Wygo Warrior, aka Julie, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Wygo stands for When You Get Old. I'm 53 years old and love and enjoy makeup, skincare, doing product reviews, beauty hauls, unboxing videos, and this year I am doing advent calendar unboxings. If you have stopped by because you're curious what is in the 2020 L'Occitane advent calendar, then you're in the right place and keep on watching. Okay, so if you've ever seen this brand, the official way you pronounce it is L'Occitane. I Google searched and found a YouTube video that explains how to pronounce the brand name. I will link it in the eye above if anyone is curious. It's L'Occitane. So you may be curious, hey, Wago Warrior, a.k.a. Julie, where's the box? Well, I actually filmed this unboxing video a couple weeks ago, and when I went to edit it, found out that the microphone was not turned on. Since then, my husband has sent the box off to the recycling plant. So I had to watch an a, a hour-plus video with no sound, and jot down the order in which I did the original unboxing. Not fun. Then I thought, hmm, do I try to do a voiceover with that video or do I just show you the product? So what I think I'm going to do is down there or down there or up someplace, I'm going to put a little square, fast forward so you can actually watch the original unboxing and then I'm just going to pull out the products and explain what we received and I'm going to do my best to get it in the order like day one through day 24 but I'm not going to lie I may mess up but at the end of the day I think what you're all looking for is to see what are the products and is it worth the price that you pay for the advent calendar so let's get into it so for starters I purchased the $74 um, advent calendar and they do have one that's like a hundred and four it's an online exclusive I got what's known as their signature advent calendar also because I spent more than $70 I'm not sure I was able to get some free samples and as always I was like fooled I think of a free sample that's free sa no they're little envelopes but or packets anyways I received three little samples and there we go the signature advent calendar to my dismay is less skincare and more what do you call it like body related, you know, hand creams, body creams, body gels, shampoos, etc. Still very lovely. And, and the products are from France, so they're all very shishi, and they smell lovely. But keep that in mind if you, like me, were thinking this was going to be more along the lines of the Kiehl's advent calendar, it is not. Anyways, let's get started with the unboxing. So day one we started with a lip balm that is super tiny. It's not even the full size. So we got a lip balm and then we got this product here which is an ultra rich cream and I believe this is a body cream. And then we got a bunch of these here. So day three and this is a hand cream. Dry skin hand cream. Alright. The next product we received is this guy here. Which is Ultra Thirst Quenching Cream. 
So this may be the only item that's for your face. I will look up and put it on the screen because honestly, I don't even know if this is for your hands or for your face. All right, next item. I know this video is going to be long and boring. Um, this here is, I believe, a serum. This is the Immortal Resist, which I believe is day 24. We got a hair conditioner. And to go with that, we got a shampoo. This here is a shampoo, but it's a Meissler shampoo. Comment down below. I, I love and enjoy Meissler water. I've never heard of a Meissler shampoo before. All right. What does the next day bring us? You got it. A hand cream. This is in the scent. It just says precious hands. So if our hands are precious, they're covered. All right. All right. The next item is actually called a precious cream. Again, if I can find information, I will link on the screen. If this is meant for your face or your hands. All right. Oh, here we have another hand cream. And this is in the scent Cherry Blossom. All right. Next day item. Can you guess? Yes. It's a hand cream. And this is in the scent uh, Ver Verbana. All right, what does the next day bring? A hand cream. This is in the scent Honey Harvest. All right, what is the next item? I am so no longer even trying to go the original days. Apologies, but all right. This here is a shower oil. Okay. Next item is, here is the shampoo that goes with that conditioner. Next day we have this item here, which is a shower gel, also in the scent Verbana. All right, next item. We have this product here, which is... SOS Lumiere. What is this? Oh, it's a hair mask. Okay. Next day, we have a hand cream. An intensive hand cream. And then next, we have this product, which is... Nay, nay. Does anyone watch um, Bailey Sarian? I've been binge watching her videos and she likes to say nay, nay. Anyways, this is not a hand cream. This is a foot cream. Just got to mix it up there. All right. And then on one of the days, we got this product here, which is a body milk. Comment down below and explain to me what a body milk is, please. Is it just some more liquidy body lotion? Uh, I'll post any information I find on that product on the screen. All right, and then we got this on one of the days, which is uh, SOS Hydration Moisturizer. Oh, it's a hair mask. Okay. And then we got this tiny sample here. This here is a light comforting cream. Again, I will list on the screen if I can figure out what a light comforting cream is. One of the days we got a bar of soap and this is in the scent. Extra gentle soap. That's not a scent. This is a vegetable soap. Not sure what 
a vegetable soap is, but this is a hand soap. And then we got a lovely little bar of soap, hand soap, and this is in the shade, or shade. This is in the scent Verbana. And then the last item, of course, is a hand cream, and this is in the scent Rose. All right, so let's recap. We got a foot cream, and we got seven hand cream samples. So I'm telling you now, if you aren't really into bougie, expensive, made in France hand creams, then this advent calendar is probably not for you. We then got some mystery creams, an aqua cream, a comforting cream, another, we got a bunch of other lotions and creams that not sure if they're body or face we got two hair products or two hair masks got two shampoos and a conditioner we got a body milk a shower gel a shower oil a lip balm and a nighttime serum and two bars of soap all right comment down below what are your thoughts do you enjoy L'Occitane products is this the first time you've heard of this brand is it worth the little tiny samples um, to be honest I was all excited online you, you know they're samples but they seem bigger than what you get um will i get this next year honestly probably not um will i use the products yes i love hand creams but i'm not sure that it's worth 74 dollars. i will list on the screen the actual price of the products taking full size and doing math with the milliliters and we'll see if it was worth what I spent my money on. All right, thank you so much for stopping by. I really do appreciate each and every one of you. Please uh, leave me a comment, uh, like the video, and if you haven't done so yet, uh, please subscribe and click the bell icon so that you're notified of future videos. Thanks, everyone.